Hello again, it's Miss Oberg. I'm so happy to see you. We are on day two of our countdown. We write the number two as around and back on the railroad track. Two, 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 two. All right, go ahead and cut this one. Put that to the side. Okay, today we are gonna read a nonfiction story called Math at the Store. This is written by Tracy Stephora. When I open this book, I see a table of contents. I see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight chapters. This gives us all of our page numbers when this chapter starts. Let's begin our story. Math at the store. I know this is the title of the chapter because it's at the top in big bold letters. There are many types of stores. People buy things at the store. People use math at the store. Hmm. Chapter two, counting. The cashier counts items. This says cashier. The cashier counts money. The baker counts cookies. This is pointing to the baker. How many loaves of bread can you count? Hmm, nice. Chapter three, sorting. This man sorts by size. Can you see the different sizes? Nice job. This man sorts by color. This woman sorts by shape. How would you sort these? Nice. Next chapter, measuring. This man measures how heavy. This is pointing to a scale. This man measures how tall. This woman measures how much. Are these people measuring how long or how heavy? What do you think? Nice. Shapes. There are many shapes in the stores. This is a triangle. This woman is holding a square box. This says square. This man works with shapes. A circle. What shape is this bag? I agree. And the end. Thank you so much for reading with me and I look forward to seeing you soon.